do you guys want to create your clips from this to this so don't worry because today I'm going to show you improved setting of the topaz and a CC that can create quality like this today's video is sponsored by promo AI promo AI is an AI tool which is packed with some crazy AI features we have a bunch of AI tools here let's check them out first we have the sketch rendering you can render your sketch into a realistic photo just like this amazing after that we have the AI image generator you just have to write what do you want in the image and the tool will generate it nice you can also replace the subject in the images just by selecting it and tell the tool what do you want in there also check out this other tool also and try out the promo AI from the link given in the description with the coupon code also ok back to the video let's open to open video AI and import our clip for the resolution we are going to use 2x of scale which is 4k and for the FPS we always use 60 in the enhancement we will set parameter from auto to manual and you guys need to copy my settings here compression can be 70 details can be 80 and sharpen will be 10 and noise reduce noise will be 10 also d hollow same as 10 and anti layers will be up to minus 100 low to i mean and click on export just wait until it's completed after enhancement we will take the clip to the after effects in after effect create an adjustment layer and add the effect called s sharpen here you need to guys copy my settings for the sharpen amp we are going to use 0.5 And for the small details, we will going to choose 5. After that, let's add unsharp mask. In unsharp mask, the amount will be 30. And the radius will be 50. As you guys can see, the quality is much better now. Now let's add the effect called looks the magic bullet looks and let's edit it here we're going to add the LUT first the LUTs in LUTs we're going to select vibrance thing after that let's add a spot exposure you guys can copy my settings here just need to give a little glow in the center just like that after that let's add a lens vignette to go give a dark shade around the corners Yes, this should be enough. I think so. Better. Now let's add a little saturation. I will set the amount to 120. Now let's add color extra. Copy my steps here. To get blue glow, we need to pull the blue outer little, outer side a little. This will give a extra saturation on blue color. Just like that, and that's it. 
now we have a amazing CC I hope you guys like the video and make sure to subscribe my channel and like this video and I hope you guys to see you in the next video take care bye bye